Hey everyone! Hello, hello, hello! How's it going? Everybody doing well? Yeah, so welcome uh, to a Ken from the car. Downstairs. <laughs> so we have a reason why it's downstairs. Yes. I know because everyone's already going to be asking, why is it downstairs? What is happening? What is going on? Mm -hmm. Listen, okay? We have, we have hot stories. We do. So we... Sean's doing stuff already. I'm just trying He's to tighten, doing tighten stuff. it up a little bit. Um, so uh, as you guys come in and say hello, uh, it has been chaos in our world. Mm -hmm. Yesterday we left... Detroit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and we were the tarmac or something. There was something wrong with it. Gateway. So we were going to be late. Or jetway. And we landed in Salt Lake City at like 10 20. 20 and our flight leaving Salt Lake City left at 10 30. So it was like a home alone scene and we were running. Uh. And Sean's yelling down like anyone's going to do it. Stop. Hold the gate. Hold the gate. Oh. Yeah. And then when we they, got there, the guy, were the guy was like, us. you're fine. It's no big deal. Yeah. I think that they told them hold it because we there have. Was, there was what? It was, was the two, last three, flight going four, out. Five, six, seven. There was like seven of us that, that they were waiting for on that, that Detroit plane. Yeah. So it was the last plane going yeah. out. It was very, very scary. Yeah. Um, and stuff so yeah. uh we are so glad you are here welcome but then when we left to spokane we didn't get home till like 11 30 mm -hmm. and then it has been chaos since getting home and then this morning the reason why we are not in the car is there is trucks blocking our entire uh entrance in where the car would be because mm -hmm. sean finally got his wish and is the getting shed. And it's a act shed it's actually done They're listen done. okay you get one wish a year. Mm -hmm. You have now used your 2020 wish. All right. So sweet. 2021 is when we the next one we'll get the twist left. This is 2019. I know, but you you've already had a lot of wishes this oh, year. Oh, I see. So <laughs> Sean got a 16 by 20 shed. They are building it. 16 by 12 by 16. Yes. I whatever. wish it was 16 by 20. I know, right? It'd be huge, but I know. So uh, that is why we're not in the car because we cannot be, uh, unfortunately, because uh, they're blocking us. Yeah. Uh, so we can't even get to our car and stuff. So, uh, literally I'm already behind on everything. Uh, we're playing catch up, which is lots of fun. So Sean and I have already been in two fights. Wonderful. But today is a very special Ken from the car. Mm -hmm. Very, very special. Yes. He has a He-Man cave or whatever. Yeah. Stuff. <laughs> so why is today a very special Ken from the car? It's very special because it was... There's a cricket access cutie! <laughs> Yes! You got it. <laughs> and it is also our 20 year anniversary. 20 years. So today anniversary. actually yeah. marks 20 years together. 20 years ago. And yeah. after these past two days, I really feel 20 is good. And we should leave on a high note. <laughs> Bye. Bye, Sean. <laughs> <laughs> See you later. And then. So, um, seriously, uh, super exciting. Uh, he forgot. And I forgot, technically, but Facebook, thank goodness for Facebook. Does anybody else wait for Facebook to say, on this day last year, you did this? And it said, on this day three years ago, you celebrated this. And I was like, and so I ran out. It's like, hi, Sean. He's like, hi. And I was like, happy anniversary. And he goes, oh, because we always play a game, who can be? And I won this you year. Won. Yeah, I, won. I think I did it last year. Yeah. I? So I bought you a shed. What Thanks did you get me? Whatever you want. What do you oh. need? <laughs> Whatever I want to see. Yeah, all that redone. Oh, man. All that redone. Which is for other people. Yeah, some. Yeah. But all right. Good. So we have a lot to chat about, um, a lot to go over. We are doing this, Ken, from the car just a smidge early because there is a super duper, extremely um, exciting promotion going on at Cricket right now for those of you mm -hmm. who like Cricket Cuties. Uh, so Cricket Cutie, or right now, if you um, spend, uh, yeah, you get a free Cricket cutie when you spend a hundred dollars on uh some products some materials i think there is something to it let me look at it really quick because i always so get a free cricket cutie when you spend a hundred dollars so spend a hundred dollars or more on materials and accessories and receive an exclusive cricket cutie but there's two little stars you gotta love little stars guys let's see what those two little star seats must be signed in with a valid Cricut Access account. Ooh. Ooh. So this is important, peeps. This is important. If you want a Cricut Cutie. And this Cricut Cutie is, um, I gave you a closer. Yeah, let's show them that one. So I think this one's called Blush. 
I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it looks like blush. Yeah, it's a blush cricket cutie. If you want him or her, what you can have you whatever you want, and it mm -hmm. can be a boy or a girl. Sure. Not only do you need to spend $100 on materials and accessories, but you have to be a Cricut Access member. So if you are not a Cricut Access member, you need to be a Cricut Access member because you're going to yes. get the Cricut Cutie, yay. Number two, you're going to get access to 100,000 plus images Whoa. in Cricut, and you're going to get 10% off off your order. So here's the deal, guys. I'm going to show you Cricut Cuties because you're going to want one. Um, but essentially, uh, right now, accessories and materials are 40% off. If you're an Access member, you get an additional 10% off. If you use 10 Ken, you get an additional 10% off. And we're going to look at everything, but I'm going to show you what these guys I'm are. Sure. So yeah. Cricut Cuties, um, essentially, were released a long, long time ago. Long, long time ago. That's all I know of that song. Um, and they didn't do so hot. Let's just be honest. Uh, the Cricut Cuties... I have no idea what machine that is. The grasshopper machine? Oh, grasshopper. You need a new grasshopper machine. I don't know what that is. Okay. Lisa, so, we'll have to look it up. I don't know what that is. Okay, so Sean, you go down here. Sure. So basically, a long time ago, Cricut released their own version of... So here's the deal. You can go back on us. Sorry. Yeah. If you've never been to a Ken from the car, even though we're from the basement, it is very chaotic and I'm all over the place. Yes. Welcome to the channel. Um, <laughs> so... Cricket, a long time ago, before even Ashish was there, they said, oh my gosh, all of these little Mickeys are doing great in Disneyland. And everyone was going around and finding Mickeys in little black packages oh, and opening it. And they're like, oh my gosh, this is this Mickey, and this is this Mickey, and this is this Mickey. And everyone was like, cray cray about it, right? So Cricket said, we're going to do the same thing. And they released 12 Cricket cuties. Well, they said they were going to release 12. They only released six. And then... They didn't finish the other six because nobody bought them because you didn't know what color you were getting. So you could get like five of one color. And then the whole point was we were going to trade with each other. It didn't really take off until Cricut started getting strong again. And people started saying, hey, where are those Cricut cuties everyone got? Now I want them. And I think they realized, oh, some of these Cricut cuties are going for hundreds of dollars on eBay. Yeah, they are. So here is the original six that I got. You can go back down here, Sean. You bet. So I only got six. They did have another six plan. They never came out. But what was cool back then is they matched machines. So the, this little guy, Cricket he cake. was the Cricket Cake, right? Which we had one. Of yep. Works. This little white guy was Cricket Imagine. Yep. Look at it. This little guy was for the Cricket Expression. So Cricket Expressions actually released a whole bunch of different colors exclusive to Walmart a long time ago, which is where this one comes from now. This little guy or girl is a uh, Ken's Creations craft room ca casualty. He's a veteran because he <laughs> fought in a war of art supplies and his little antenna broke, but we fixed it. You know, it's not perfect. He's going to need to see a plastic surgeon, but you know. Then this guy was the green Christian cricket expressions. And then this one was the cricket expressions to match the breast cancer awareness. And you can see that right there. So these were the original six that came out. And I got them all. They never released the other set of six. Um, so it's very sad. There was going to be a it's gypsy sad. one. There was going to be a whole bunch of stuff. Mm -hmm. Ryan's monitoring questions. So if there's a question, he can interrupt us. It's you yes. know, him from the car. Um, so the other six never came out. I wish they did. There was a cool gypsy one. There was all these different ones. So these six don't even look on the eBay. They're crazy, crazy bill. But they have released a ton more. So let's take a look at these guys. Um, we'll get picture in picture too for you. What's up, Ryan? So someone asked, do you not have the gold one? But uh, we're getting there. We're right. getting there. That's what simmer. I said. I said we're hey, getting there. Simmer down, people. Simmer. <laughs> listen. Where's my ear? Listen. I just told him you had a lot. Listen. <laughs> listen. Do you not think? Have you not met me? Like, did you, I have this thing called where I need the entire set of things? So yeah. I literally have them all. We're going to show them to you all because mm -hmm. I have an addiction, right? I need the whole set. So they released these, not this one. They released these four initially to match the brand new Cricut Explore Air 2 colors. So you have the mint, the blue, the lilac. Look at them. They're so cute. Right? Look at all those. Is that what the blush? No, this is the pink. Oh, it's pink. Yeah. Very light pink. Yes, right. Someone asked, is there a maker one or is there a maker collection yet? So this is the maker collection technically because all of the makers come in these colors. Oh. 
Yeah, so the Cricut Explore Air 2, not lean. So the machine colors, if you guys haven't noticed, on Cricut, they have these colors. And mint is a color, lilac's a color, blue's a color, and rose pink's a color. Yep. So there's an Explore Air 2 in this, and all these colors. And the mint, if you think about it, matches all these colors. Yep. So these came out to celebrate those, right? But then, oh yes, they released metallic. Cutie. So this is the gold, which kind of matches the Cricut Explore Air. It came in a gold, and it also came in a metallic wisteria is what they wisteria. called it. So that's all of them, right? Okay, so we have all of these. Then they released the Raspberry Cutie. And look at him, he's so bright. Because there's a Raspberry Cricut Explore Air 2. Mm -hmm. And then came the Flamingo Cutie. Once again, matches an Expression Air 2. And then, if wow. you were lucky enough to go to some of the events, or know someone that went to the events, you could get the Cobalt Blue wow. That's Cricket a pretty one. Cutie. Now, I need this, so I'm going to be placing my $100 order because obviously my set is not complete without this. And the color of this one is, um, is a little... I think it's blush. I think they're officially calling it blush. But, um... Let's go to my computer, Sean, really sure quick. Let me thing. push this up for you. I'll wait. You will wait. So listen, Linda's. Okay. Listen. So here, this is important. So this is the color that you're going to get. Now, here's a big important rule. This little Cricut Cutie, I think it's blush. I'm almost positive they're calling it blush, is while supplies last. So you want to make sure that if you want this Cricut Cutie, a couple things are gonna have to happen. And those and things are, Sean, what are those things? To be able to get it? Yes. Gotta spend $100. Yes. And you have to be a Cricut Access person. Yes. Oops, sorry, that was the wrong one. So um, basically, yeah, we're gonna go back to full screen here and not worry about picture in picture for a little bit of time. There we go. So if you want these Cricut, this Cricut Cutie in blush, you need to be a Cricut Access member. Mm -hmm. You need to spend at least $100 or more on materials and accessories. Now, materials and accessory $100 is before discount, shipping, tax, all that stuff. So let's say you spend $100, your Cricut Access member brings it down to 90, you use 10 can, it brings it down to like 80. You need to be at your final subtotal of $100 or more to get this Cricut Cutie. Now, Cricut Cuties, usually when they're out, they're out and they do not come back, which is very sad. So if you are a collector as I am, um, you will definitely want to grab this. Uh, some of you might say, well, Ken, why do I need it? So, Sean, can we show my computer really I quick? I sure can. So the reason why, I always tell people, act now. Here is my original green Cricut cutie, Cricut Expression. He's going for $300. <laughs> Look at some of the cost prices on the black market, as I call it. This is where all the Cricut cuties turn into little slaves, and they are sent. The cobalt's 41 47 The gold is... Look at this, the blue is 112 right now. Our, this is crazy, 120. Like it's it's legit. Oh my gosh, this one's in the original box. You don't even know what's in that. That's the box they came in, everyone. So when they originally re released them, look at this. Let's let's show you this closer. This is a this is like this is like seeing a lion in the wild. So <laughs> this is the box they came in. This is cool. So this is cricket, three-inch vital figures. So this is the, how they came. You didn't know what you were getting. And here, so they released the expression. They released the imagine. Mm -hmm. They did not release the gypsy. They did not release the champagne cricket expression, which is this one down here. They released, um, they did not release the hunter green. They released the dark blue. They released the breast cancer, but they did not release the turquoise or the cricket create. So those are the ones that were never released. And then there was a mystery edition one. So. Um, that one's sealed. Oh my gosh, $325. That's insane. Wow. See, rare Cricut Cutie Cricut Cake retired $325. This could be wow. my retirement. So that is why I always stress, get this cutie. Sorry, Sean, you can go back to both screen. Okay. Ryan, do you have a question? Yes, so... Uh, and as a asked, is the holiday mystery box still available? I've been trying to order it for the past two days and it keeps on giving me an error message. It is. The holiday, so there's two different things. Okay, listen, there is a lot happening right now. Listen, because there is a lot of sales at Cricut. So let's 
cover those sales. Mm -hmm. So the first one is the hundred dollars. You get a cutie. Just a second, we gotta get off picture and picture. Yep. Too much stuff is going on for Shawnee. So the first thing is, is hello, get a free Cricut cutie, right? Mm -hmm. So, but right now, Easy Presses are starting at $49. The Easy Press Mini is $49 and it goes up from there, but they are all on sale. The next one is, um, oh, just a sec, sorry guys, Sean's, Sean's having some switcher issues. Oh, so go. also there is 20% off all sale, uh, or excuse me, all clearance items if you're a Cricut Access member. Then there is these things called holiday bundle materials. These are all fun bundles, which we're gonna show you in a second. It is 40% off all materials and tools, and I mean all materials and tools. It is 30% off all infusible inks. You can get a Cricut Explore Air 2 starting at $200. And the Spootacular box is still available for $39.99. So we're going to quickly show you up close. Mm -hmm. If you have questions, please let Ryan know. But if you want the Cricut Cutie, I would definitely put an order. Please use the links down below. These links help support our channel, and we thank you for that. We have a huge announcement coming up, too. We have some exciting news. Um, but let's talk about these sales because it's a lot. So first up, um, let me share my computer for all of you. So first and foremost, you can get um, Cricut Maker starting at $399, uh, the $49 for the Easy Press. But uh, the what you possibly are asking is the holiday bundle. So let's go take a look at these. So some of these are sold out, so you cannot get them. But the ones that are still in stock, these are a pretty good deal. So one and two are out of stock. Wah, wah. These were all happening when I was in Ontario. Um, so I didn't even know they were really happening. So I apologize for not alerting you guys. But let's take a look at these. So like holiday bundle number five normally is $40. You're getting it for $12.99 before discounts. And then this one you are getting all stars and spa day in sport flex. And sports flex, for those of you who do not know, is for people that wear jerseys or um, sports type things that have the stretch to it. And you are able to... Uh, stretch it mm. so that's holiday bundle number five they have all of these bundles tons of great deals like you have some here that has uh mickey and friends cardstock zootopia cardstock and all of this it's normally 87 dollars for 29.99 holiday bundle number four i've given you the link directly to the holiday bundle because there is so many yes ryan so our uh here you Pratima. thank you Pratima yeah. has do you know if they'll be creating bald heads for Cricut instead of like the mini or the cuties? I don't know that. Um, you can go back up to us for a while. Um, I do know Cricut cuties is a big deal. I don't know if they're making bobble heads or I, I don't know. I didn't even know this Cricut cutie. Unfortunately, as I'm no longer a product expert, I don't get insight to that fun information. However, I do know Cricut cuties are a huge deal. People love them. So whenever a Cricut Cutie comes out, it's always going to be tied usually to a promotion. So an in-person event. So when Ashish went to all of the Michaels, that's how you got the Cobalt Blue. You met him at a Michaels, you got this one. Um, these two were offered with the Lilac in the um, beginning of the year. They had these bundles. They were called Cricut Cutie bundles and they came with material. And they were $99. You got a Cricut Cricut cutie and you got all the material so they're always tied some way um it wouldn't surprise me if they ever came out with bobbleheads little ones of them big ones of them i i mean they're huge forget cuties are huge i know we, we when we were there last they said it would be great to bring back the the plush i know the plush is huge too people yep. miss that little plush guy yes right and then so janet gerber asked if you could only buy one easy press which size would you recommend just one that's a hard question because mm. originally I would have said the 12 by 10 easy, um, but I kind of feel like everyone needs the 12 by 10 and now the mini. I was not sold on the mini guys. I was not sold on it. I was like, this is stupid. It's a little tiny iron. Then I got it and then it clicked and I was like, this is amazing. It heats up super quick. It's handheld You it for infusible ink. It's amazing. So in a perfect world, I would say the 12 by 10 and the mini for $49.99. Um, but 12 by 10, really, we use a lot because we do pillows. So uh, the 9 by 9 is a good size. But, but if I had to choose between the three regular sizes, it would be the 12 by 10. I don't do a lot of baby onesies. So the small one, I don't use the baby one. 
Um, but I use that mini a lot. I love the mini. All right, guys. So um, back really quick to these holiday bundles. These are as supplies last. So definitely take a look like this bundle here. Look at this. Normally $92 for 30 bucks. I mean, it is insanity. Also, um, they have the Bright Pad at um, $59, I think, $59.99. Yes, and I always point this out when it comes to even accessories, everything. So anything under the accessory category, so this is the accessory category. So you see here, this is going to include all of your blades going to include all of the maker tools it's going to include your cutting your mats your easy press mats all of those are 40 percent off so all the machine tools all the mats all the craft tools the um all of those are 40 percent off the infusible ink is 30 percent off but materials are 40 percent off so vinyl iron on paper infusible inks 30 remember makers 40 others 40 so you ha can easily get up to that $100 uh, dollar minimum. So you can come back up to us, Sean, real quick. Um, so it is a huge sale, and that's why I'm going early, because I don't want you to miss out on the Cricut Cutie. Um, did I already order to make sure I sure I got one before all of you? Maybe, I don't know. Of course. Possible. Listen. Maybe seven? Listen, if I don't have this one, I might hyperventilate. <laughs> you know, because I'm trying to figure out the display of what to put them in. They're super cute. I need them. So it is the blush. So blush cutie is very limited stock and will run out. If they run out of the blush, they will replace it with a random Cricut cutie. Um, you do have to be a Cricut Access member. And remember, it has to be $100 on accessories and materials before tax, shipping, and all that stuff. So your subtotal needs to say 100 Yes, Ryan. So, Joanne, uh, the show. Uh, Hi, Joanne. Hi, Joanne. Uh, so do you think this sale is better than the upcoming Black Friday deals? Well, I don't know the Black Friday sale because I'm not a, I, and even if I did, I couldn't talk about it. I'm trying to remember, I think last year, don't quote me, it was 50% off like accessories and materials for like a certain amount of time. I don't know what it's going to be this year. Um, I will tell you that I, without a doubt, if you are not interested in the Cricut Cutie, you might want to wait to see what's Black Friday. If you want that Cricut Cutie, I would not wait because he's going to go quick. Um, so just, just to quickly go over again, 40% um, off all materials, 40% off all accessories, 40% off even maker tools, 30% off infusible ink. You have the Cricut Maker on sale, the Cricut Explorer Air 2 on sale. Easy presses are on sale, bright pads on sale, the Cricut mystery box, the spooktacular mystery box, it's a physical mystery box, is still in stock. The Disney digital mystery box is still in stock. I have a video on all of that. If you are on Facebook, there is the links. Um, there is a master link list that will take you to everything. Uh, make sure you're using the right coupon codes. I get, even gave you videos on what is infusible ink and machine reviews. So. I'm super excited about the Cricut. I don't, mm -hmm. any questions before we move on from Cricut? Nope. Okay, so big thing on that is if you use your, our links, we were forever grateful, thank you. Uh, by using the links, it does help support us, which is uh, um, awesome. Quick note on when you're sending a link, take off the HTTP and stuff, just www, then they'll actually go in to all the sites. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. When it does that little frowny face. Yeah, it doesn't like that. It doesn't. Uh, Facebook I'm, doesn't like it. Facebook hates it. Yeah. So, um, I know jumping up and down. I know. So, a couple of things. Um, uh, we are on Twitch. So, anyone that's been watching our Chocolatura channel, our Forty Five Days Alive, know that we've been on Twitch. We're going to be on Twitch a lot more. So, for all of our friends on Twitch, thank you. Uh, we love Twitch. It's a better uh, quality of video. It's a better resolution. So we are big fans of Twitch. So definitely hop over there and become a Twitch member. And you can actually support a Twitch person using your uh, Amazon Prime account. And you get to choose who that is. So if that's us, we thank you for that because that does actually help us. And then, um, uh, oh, sorry, Rafatim. Rafatima, uh, just donate. Fatima. It just, it's Fatima. It's Fatima. It's Fatima. Uh, donate 300 uh, bits on Twitch. Oh, thank you. I don't you. know what that is. What is bits? So bits are like, they're the currency of like, hey, if you want to donate, I think a, a dollar's a thousand. 
So basically, if they donate, you know, it's just basically like oh. once you get enough, you'll be able to exchange it for cash or other cool, you know, stuff for. I feel very old right now. And then she also <laughs> subscribed to us on Twitch. Thank we you. Love her. <laughs> She's great. Yes. So, anyways, we are on Twitch. We're super excited. Um, everyone asks, can I support you on Amazon because I'm Christmas season's coming up. The, any link that I ever give you for Amazon is an affiliate link and it will help support us anywhere between two and 8% depending on the product. So just use that link. Um, I will let you guys know, a lot of people will say, hey, I used your coupon code. Most of the time coupon codes are for you guys, which mm -hmm. is great, you get amazing discounts, but you have to use our links to get compensated. And here's the deal, a lot of people now have ad blockers or um, they clear their cookies and cash and that erases all the links. So always use the, the most recent video links. Um, also, we have a Patreon account. Definitely take a look at our Patreon account. And we are super excited because Art Impressions has just accepted us as an affiliate. So for those of you mm. who know who Art Impression is, I love their stamps. Um, they gave me a personal invite that I'm super excited about. Mm -hmm. So um, we are going to talk about some more deals that you guys can get. But overwhelmingly, the number one question I have gotten in the past week besides what did Sean do to his wrist is <laughs> when is your artwork sale coming up? So uh, we have finally decided it will be this Sunday, November 17th, 2019. We are doing it in hour increments. So we'll go from 9 a.m. to 10 a.m. We'll take a break from 10 to 11. Then we will go 11 to 12. Take a break from 12 to what? Oh, that should be then 11. No, yeah. 12 to 1, it should be, I guess we'll take a little bit of a break there. Then it'll be 2 to 3, take a break from 3 to 4, and we'll start the last one at 4. So 9, 11, 2, and 4, there will be four segments. I have, oh, you wow. can come back to me, Sean, and talk to people. Let me count to tell you how many I have, guys, because it's pretty crazy. That's great. So everything you see back here basically is going, except that will not. That's just our thingy, but almost all this stuff will go. Um, the stuff that's over here will be going as well. The paper probably will not. We have, I think, over 70 things that we're auctioning Ooh. off. Yes. It's gonna be insane. Now, um, some of you have been asking, what is this going to? So normally our auctions always go to Watts of Love. Yep. And uh, that it will not change. However, um, as many of you know, <laughs> Uh, our lovely Toby, who we would do anything for, Toby Joseph, ended up in the emergency vet clinic um, over the past few weeks, and we just got our bill in the mail, and it is right around five thousand dollars after all surgeries and everything. So um, this first auction part of it will go towards helping us pay that off, as well as Watts of Love. So we will still be making donations to Watts of Love. I don't want you guys thinking we're not going to do that. But some of it is going to help us get caught up because obviously that was a little um, out of the blue for us. And we had already committed to going to Canada and buying those flight tickets and everything. So we're a little upside down here. Yes, Ryan. So Claire Hills on YouTube asks, uh, how does the chalkathon type of thing work? So the chalkathon, um, essentially we go live. Mm -hmm. We have multiple people on multiple computers checking live as well because we do know there's a delay but essentially what would happen is we put down um here sean will show you kind of the feel for it the feel let me put all my cricket cuties back in their little cricket a chalk foam. so essentially what would happen is normally we would put down a piece we'll say this is you know the snowman blah 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 and what we do is we say there's three minutes on the timer. We put a phone out there with the timer and then we say go. And then people essentially can start bidding um, and they bid. And then we usually say 10 seconds left, five seconds left. And, and then at and, the end and, of the timer, mm -hmm. we say, okay, time is done. And we literally say now. And so what ends up happening is everyone on their computers, which we have about three, literally wait for that now to happen on their end because of the delay. Um, and then essentially that's, we we'll, we actually say right then, so-and-so got it for this amount and then we send an invoice to you and then you pay for it. Um, we also do giveaways during the time because we know a lot of people aren't necessarily specifically bidding on an item, but they still want to give to the charity and we do a lot of giveaways. We add these little kind of um, uh, crafty stashing and we put it in a box and we just kind of throw things in every time someone gives us a dollar or three dollars we throw it in mm -hmm. and then essentially um, once it's all said and done 
we send out invoices once it's paid um, and everything we ship it out to you this time we do have to charge for shipping um, because there's just reasons I have to charge for shipping. I won't go into a ton of it. It's a policy thing. But anyways, uh, so we will be charging, but it, we will be splitting it with you guys. So normally shipping is a little expensive. We're going to make it as cheap as possible. It will be a flat, no matter what size board you get, just to help um, so that we are charging you for that shipping charge. Uh, so the, it always starts at the price of whatever the frame is. So I'm not putting in any cost for like my time or the materials or the transfers I use whatever the board so for example this is a sylvie board this is a 1999 board it would start at 20 dollars and go up from there essentially any, any questions you? mr ryan um or comments um so let me find it um um 82 from twitch asked will this only be on youtube it will so it gets really hard we tried doing it on Facebook and YouTube, but it gets really hard to monitor all of the different things. Um, so it will be broadcast on Ken's Creations YouTube, not my Chocotour. I'm, I'm, I have to separate it from that because there is other things that will be in this broadcast besides Chocotour. And because I'm not actually chalking or selling chalk products, I'm just selling the completed pieces. Um, we're going to do it on the Ken's Creations channel. Mm -hmm. I will be promoting it. I'll be pushing it out to everyone, the times and everything. Um, and we don't really do anything besides kind of chat and, you know, uh, auction off the pieces and do a lot of fun giveaways and stuff like that. So it's a lot of fun. Yep. Yeah. Okay, guys. So, um, some other quick little things besides the massive Cricut sale that you definitely need to be taking advantage of. Don't want to, I, I want to let you guys know 651 Vinyl has given us a coupon code, get five. That gets 5% off anything in their store including the new silhouette cameo 4 um and they have those santa sacks they have new holiday patterns um they carry a product called starcraft vinyl and htv and that starcraft company has been hinting at something new coming out and i i i do i cannot confirm this i'm not i don't know anything i don't know starcraft i don't i'm not don't know them but i'm hoping it's glitter mm -hmm. we may have been using some glitter that we've gotten from to test and hopefully that's coming out soon because it's amazing stuff and um so just be on the lookout for an announcement from us when that goes because it's pretty epic stuff um for those of you who missed last week on ken's creations we did foundation decor we made those uh amazing welcome signs and they have given us a exclusive coupon code so it's kk10 get you 10 percent off um, or is it five percent off? It's ten percent off anything on their site. Mm -hmm. I don't know why it says five percent off. I must have had a typo. It's ten percent <laughs> off, um, or maybe it is. Well, now I don't know. Now you don't know. I'll go look. Um, but they have really cute stuff. The welcome sign. They have the home with the different. Uh, you can switch out the O's and stuff like that. Um, so definitely just use KK10. You'll get some. You'll get stuff off. Uh, Silhouette, as you guys always know, I have links help support us. If you use those links, 10 off, get you 10% off. And then I just gave you all my stuff about Chalk Tour. I've been getting a influx of questions of people that are saying, oh, gosh, the more I look at it, I'm interested in Chalk Tour. Can you tell me about it? So all those links are down below. Thank you. That was a lot mm -hmm. before we get to the, all the other stuff. What else? Any questions? Are we good? Okay. So Cricket is the big thing. Don't forget. All right, so we already announced our uh, um, we did that. our auction, so yeah. that's so cool. So everyone said, "Where were you? What happened?" So we went to London, Ontario. One of my team members, um, her name is Isabel, is uh, one of the designers that joined uh, right when Canada launched, and she has a team up there, and they had. Couture Tour, which is basically Chalk Couture goes on tour and we go talk to people and you're going to meet the CEO and everything. And I committed to going to that. I was like, I'm going to be there. And then Cameo 4 came out and Silhouette said, can you please come to the Cameo 4 release party? And so we said yes and then had to cancel our, our Couture Tour. So to try to make up for it, we went up there to meet the team and to meet Isabel and just kind of see how Chalk Couture is going in Canada. And it was a great trip. It was a long flight, but uh, her house is stunning. She actually lives in a church that has been converted to a house um, in Canada, especially in Sparta and different areas. Um, 
they used to have little churches for every single little town. And there wasn't enough people going to the churches because obviously more people are going to bigger churches now and, and, you know, that have preschools and schools attached and stuff. So they had all of these churches and towns that were abandoned. And some little towns have two churches or three churches. I think they have two. Yeah, they have two. So they actually go in and convert as long as there is not no. a grave site on it. Yep. They cannot do it if there's a grave site. But if there's no grave site, they actually convert these churches into homes. Mm-hmm. So hers is literally, it's a church that has been converted. It's beautiful, yep. huge 20-foot ceilings. 20-foot I mean, ceiling, 20-foot it's, ceilings. It's a church for sure. It's gorgeous. So we got to spend the week there. I may or may not have done a little bit of redone hunting. Oh, boy. Okay, guys, let me tell you something. First of all, it's plentiful, Ray Dunn, up there. Listen, listen, Dunnies, listen. Canada is plentiful, number one. Number two, (laughs) they're super nice. They, like, don't hit each other. Like, they don't fight. Number three, they bring stuff out from the back room for you to look at it. When they say, what are you looking for? I'm like, Ray Dunn stuff. We have two carts. Let me go get it. And I'm like, wait, what? What? I'm like, what? (laughs) We're going to go down there weekly. (laughs) Yeah, exactly. What's your question, Ryan? So... Julia, is it uh, Julia Child? No. no. Okay. Yeah, no. Yeah. Uh, Julia Satter White asked, "How did you like Brian and Jazzy's life from the car?" So she meant, she meant Ryan, I think, instead of Brian. Yeah. I um have not watched it because when they went live, we were in the airplane, and then when we got to um Canada, my whole goal was really to kind of um buy done. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> my whole goal there was to be with. Isabel and her family, mm-hmm. and they went above and beyond. They took us into town. We went to great dinners. We got to meet a lot of the team members. We had an opportunity call. They have amazing dogs. Great dinners, meaning they I have, made them. Yes, you made dinners. Um, <laughs> they um, had. Uh, they have three kiddos that we got to get to know, and it was like almost every second of the day was kind of planned. So I did start watching it. I do know they el- ate a lot of my healthy food, so that's good. That's and. Awesome. They said it's disgusting, which is quite funny because while they were eating all the healthy foods, let me show you what I was eating. Sure. After we gloated about how Ken's so healthy and good. Okay, so here's the deal. (laughs) Canada does candy right. I am just telling you. First of all, there's these things. I don't know what they... Okay, well, no, first of all, get back up here. Let Listen, yeah. Canada. Canada, Justin Thurdo, or whatever your prime minister's name is. I have no idea why you do not have Uncrustables. They literally are life-changing. Like, life-changing. Yes, they are. It is better than making your own peanut butter and jelly sandwich. And they don't really get it. Like, I was trying to explain it to them. They were all kind of like... Looking at you, you're going... Like, it's just do peanut what? butter and jelly sandwich. I'm like, it's not, though. It's magic. Like, I need Uncrustables. They don't... not. They don't have them. They don't know what they are. Like... They looked at me like I was crazy. Like, I was in the grocery store. I'm like, where's your Uncrustables? And they're like, what? I was like, your Uncrustables. Like, the frozen peanut butter and jelly sandwich. They're like, well, you can buy bread and peanut butter and jelly. And I was like, <laughs> you don't get this. You Listen, like the there's, <laughs> yes, there, the, it's a thing. And it does taste different than an, a peanut butter sandwich. I will say that when Michaela and I bought it first time, we're like, wow, we're rich. Like, we, we, we made it. Once you get Uncrustables, you know you've made it in life. <laughs> so, for four of them, it's $2.98. At Walmart here. Mm-hmm. So, anyways, they don't have Uncrustables. They also don't have Yoshida sauce. Nope. It's very fancy teriyaki sauce. <laughs> Listen, it's the best stuff. Sean was very disappointed. But yeah, but I think do. I did. I made yes. do with what we had. Yes. Okay, Ron, I am not monitoring the chat at all, so I hope you are. Okay, so um, you have never heard of Uncrustables? I know, right? They are amazing. So, we'll get one. so here's the deal about Uncrustables. Four... I don't think we have any. Are you all out? They you ate know, them all. You ate them all? Mm-hmm. No, we had to throw was... some, yeah, we had to throw some away. They got really hard because they were left out in the little bowl. They got really hard and gross. No, you only take out what you need. Not you well, no, the, ba- the, the bag, there was two left out that... You oh. never throw Uncrustables away. I mean, they were really hard. I don't care. Like a rock. Uncrustables are amazing because literally they're frozen. You put them in a kid's... Pull it up on the... Lunch sack yeah. and then they go and by lunch it's... Thawed. and the bread is so soft and delicious like and i can eat one one entire one in my mouth like i love them um let's see i think a couple people the first person asked real quick sorry um uh i don't know how to say this name hi ken and sean where did you get the large wooden cakes and wool behind you we made those on our glow forge 
There you go. Um, uh, so uh, Uncrustables are these. So essentially, they're amazing. They're by Schmuckers. I don't think Schmuckers is, is really up in Canada because I didn't see any Schmuckers um, because everything up in Canada is called No Name. Well, not everything. It's, it's Pretty much that's, No Name. That's just their... Look at this. Look at this. They're amazing. I'm just telling you, if you've never had Schmuckers, um, you need it in your life. Yep. What's your favorite flavor? Grape or strawberry? Strawberry. strawberry. And then the UK grape, also doesn't... grape is gross. UK doesn't have them either, yep. I know. It's very sad. Who doesn't have them? Like, okay. I feel very yeah. fancy being in America not having and having something they don't have. Even though most adults are like, it's peanut butter and jelly, who cares? Okay, so, but what do they have? Um, let's show them this. So, they have this cookie company down there called Celebration. And their biscuits, they're very big on biscuits there. Um, but this one had amazing, I just brought back, here's the deal, I had a whole bunch of stuff I wanted to bring back, but- Running out of room. We ran out of room. So I left a lot of this. They have these cookies, and they are fancy, like, like dip them in coffee, and they're like, they also had ones with caramel in it, and they had ones that were like little- um, Wafer cookies. Wafer cookies, and then they had one with dark chocolate on mm -hmm. it. Now Ryan, I know you're not a big chocolate fan, but still, try I, this. It's not gonna be bad. Here's the deal. Here's the, listen, if you can find these, find them and put a toasted marshmallow on them. And oh, dear God. I, oh, my God. It's because of their chocolate. Their chocolate is different in Canada. I don't know how. They use real sugar. Is that what it is? Probably. This, this chocolate is good. Like, holy. Is their this what people think tastes like to real people? Like chocolate? That's holy like, cow. Chocolate, our chocolate <laughs> sucks. Holy I'm cow. You. I'm telling you, Canada chocolate, man, they got going on. Mm -hmm. So they do have Snickers up there. They have other things, but for the most part, they don't have it because they have this amazing candy. And if you have not seen this candy, um, I didn't get all of them because I've eaten some of them. And I didn't buy the regular old Henry because it's not my favorite, but so they have O. Henry, which we used to have O. Henry. We did. We might still in some places. But this is Reese's Peanut Butter O. Henry, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, Ryan, yes. So the same person asked about the tags. Um, well, but Ch Char asked, uh, Ken, did you see the bright yellow cutie they gave out in the UK? Someone from the UK needs to give me that right we'll, now. We'll trade you some Uncrustables. <laughs> I will find you Uncrustables. <laughs> I don't know who has one, but I need it in my life. Um, no, I don't have the bright yellow. I didn't hear that there was a bright yellow one. Apparently, they paid $100 for the plushie on eBay. Oh, it's a plushie? No, quite. I did not know there was a bright yellow cutie. Uh -huh. Was it a plushie? Or was it... Mm. Okay, you can't get my intriguing like this. And then... <laughs> Cricket, cutie, UK, yellow. The bright yellow cutie. Oh, I bet you they did because there is a bright yellow Cricket Expression, or uh, Cricket Expression, Cricket Explore Air 2. If anyone has one, you can have Sean, and I will give it. Okay, <laughs> so this is the O. Henry P Peanut Butter. It really is very close to a Nut Rages. What's so, that? A Nut Rages? Yeah. Reese's Pieces Nut Rages? Yeah, Reese's Pieces. It's like peanut inside. butter with, no, that's the updated one. It's just like this. It literally tastes like it has this. Reese's Pieces. Oh, I, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's all right. Chocolate is better there. I'm just saying. What, someone was saying that you, um, in the, it's, Jeffrey said that we put too much wax on our chocolate and that's why it tastes weird. I'm going to give it a look. Really? Okay, was there really a Cricut Cutie in Yellow Release? I need to know this right now. You guys, I'm so distracted during the Ken from the car, and now I'm looking for this Cricket Cutie. Bright yellow cutie. Cricket Cutie UK. Let's look it up. Nothing. Nothing. If there was, it's not on eBay. Um, was it a Cricket Cutie or was it a, was it a Cricket Plush? I don't know. Okay, so Owen Henry is good, but this is what won my heart once I went there. So here's, we'll go back to us. Here's what happened. We got there literally beginning in November, so it was right after Halloween, and they had a whole bunch of their kids' candy. And so I'm just going through, and I'm like, oh, cool, I love, you know, I love my um, my Smarties, because here we call them M&Ms. Up there, they're Smarties. What we consider in America Smarties, they call Rockets. And then they said, have you, probably one of my favorite things is something called a Crispy Crunch, and oh. Is that Butterfinger? 
It's basically Butterfinger. Different. Way better though. Way, you, no, 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 I'm telling you right he now. Tried, he tried you're it. gonna. You didn't like it. Nope, you didn't like it. I'll, I'll try it again. But what is I, I, wrong with you? Butterfinger is the worst. M and M's and Butterfinger is the worst. Butterfinger mm. makes me sick. The new mm. Butterfinger is horrible. Yeah, they changed what, Butterfinger. Oh, okay. This is. Did you try this? Uh, yeah, I tried a little bite of it. I'll try it again. But what don't you like about it? It doesn't taste like Butterfinger. It tastes good. Like it tastes really crisp. I'm telling you, crispy crunch. Mm -hmm. I, I don't like. Yeah, what is it you don't like? What is the taste of I don't like that um It's called it's called heaven. That's what heaven tastes like, Brian. <laughs> I don't know, I don't it just has a weird taste. Okay, listen, no, Rain, you're gonna be fired. Nobody likes you, Rain. Go away. Oh. Sorry, Ida. Um uh, We Sean says we have O Henry, but I can't find them. I think we had them like in the seventies or eighties. I don't and if we do, they're not we don't have the peanut butter version. No. And I didn't, the, the regular version was okay. Instead of peanut butter, they put caramel in it, I think. And then Lori from Facebook asked, did you, uh, did you try any Picard peanuts or nope. chip nuts? We did not get a chance to we go there. We didn't get to go there because they had a snowstorm come in on our last day and it really interrupted our plan. So we didn't get to go try those nuts. Okay. Thanks, so. Um. So, Sean, why don't you show them what's our next candy we'll try for them? Um... Next one, I guess, would be either the Double Decker or the Mr. Big. We haven't tried the Double Decker. No. Oh. But Mr. Big is and then they really have a, good. Then they have a big Mr. Big. Then they have a big Mr. Big. And look at the look at the size difference. Well, there's two of them in there, but they're they're even bigger than the one that's in here. She said the uh, Celebration cookies are on Amazon. What are those? The cookies we just had. The chocolate. Oh, the Celebration! <laughs> I didn't even know their name, Sue. That's so funny. So, um, so the celebration cookies are amazing. Those, yeah, very. Um, good. So they have. Let me see if I can find you all of them, guys, because I'm telling you, I th I'm pretty sure they thought I was crazy there. I, I kept every time I went. The, Jeff, who is Isabel's husband, would go to the store. I'd be like, I'll, I'll just go for you, and Sean's like, he's gonna buy stuff, and I would buy. I, I went through a. Let's just say they don't call the Sour Patch Kids up there are called like man charts. Yeah. It's very well, weird. It's neat. It's, I think they have new mango it. up there. And. Mm -mm. Sour Patch Kids Mango? Yeah, we have the Sour Patch Kids Mango. We have the Tropical. It's not Sour, it's not sour Patch. Eat. No, I don't think we do. I think we do. Um, so, I'm going to tell you about these celebration cookies again because they. Oh, yeah, there they are. They there like, they are. They taste like chocolate covered mm -hmm. uh, grits, but like better. Oh mm -hmm. no, that's not even the best one. They have one that has caramel in it, you guys. It is. I know you don't. Like it. it might be better though because they might use. It's so tiny and little caramels barely in there. It might be good. It's so good. I can't even tell you how good it is. <laughs> no Ryan. calories, right? There's no calories in Canada. Someone told me that. <laughs> they literally said, "You're fine, Ken." There's. No. Oh, said, that's true. See, yeah. See, on the back of the package, there's no calories. Yeah. Just... There is also no yellow cricket cutie. I'm just saying. All right. Send so, a picture. Um, so the big, wow. so I didn't think I was going to like Mr. Big, okay? Because I kept on thinking, that's the guy from Carrie and Sex in the City, right? <laughs> that's what they call Mr. Big, right? Mr. Big. Um, so once again, it was, okay, so everything up there is made by Cadbury. Like everything, like everything's Cadbury up there. So I don't know what that's all about. Like if there you have a Monopoly or whatever. But, so once I ran out, because I literally ate all the kids crispy crunchy. Not even oh, kidding. Oh no. Mm hmm Gone. We went through that whole back pill and took it. And, okay, here, I have a question. When you were a kid trick-or-treating, did anybody give you chips? Potato yeah. Chip, potato chips. We got, we got, uh, rarely you'd get chips. We got, like, apple chips. No, apple chips we got. And, like, goldfish, there, they give Pringles and little yeah, things. Yeah, we've gotten those. And then chips. I don't it's remember that. Cheez -Its, cheez -Its, like, small bags of, like, those little fun size cheeses. But, no, we didn't really get, like, Lay's and that stuff. But we got, like, Cheez-Its and little size Pringles. Yeah, very very unique. Well, it's sort of yeah. Um, so okay, back to what I was saying. Okay, we're gonna show you what Mr. Big's like. Okay, guys. Okay, just listen. Okay, so all it says because I can't. Everything's in French there. It doesn't really tell you. It just says it's Mr. Big original. So it's great for sharing. Like I'm gonna share. So this is what it looks like. It's like caramel and crunchy rice krispies. And like peanuts, is there no peanuts in it? It's all crispy. I don't know. It's, it's magic. Okay, this you're gonna love. I swear to you, 
you go up to Sean and you gotta explain what this is. Like, what would you say? To, oh yeah, it's like they took a rice crispy treat, put caramel in it, coated it in caramel, and then put really good chocolate over it. Mm. Mr. Big's got it going on. It is red. What does this taste like? Do we have a candy Heaven. here? No, do we have a candy here that tastes like this? No, we do not. We do not. I know our candy here. Jasmine we do not. and I just had something last week. What is it? It's not that. It's not this. I guarantee you, this is heaven. Like, I feel like I need to move to Canada just for their candy. Uh, the, you know the, the wafer cookies? Mm -hmm. It's not like that. That's what they taste like, but if you had caramel, that's what it tastes like to me. Mm -hmm. They're really they good. Are though, yeah. They are taking They're like nope. crunchy and... Vanilla I, wafers. Oh my gosh, I can't. So I bought some of those to eat or give away. We didn't try this, but supposedly this is a big thing in the UK. It's called the double decker because of the thing. Oh, here you go. So this is called the double decker because of I think it's more popular in the UK. Looks like it, it's Milky Way on top and something crispy down below. So music. Oh my god! I'm out of here. I can't handle this. Their chocolate. What is with their chocolate? Why does Canada and the UK have such better chocolate than us? We put so much because stuff we put wax on ours. Yeah, I was gonna say music. Oh. Music chick art from YouTube said we are big on giving giving chips out here for Halloween in Toronto. Yes, I did try a Wonder Bar. I didn't like the Wonder Bar. I mean, I did not like it. It just reminded me of a Snickers, I think. Yeah, we didn't. I didn't love the Wonder Bar. It was all right. My jam was the Krispy Crunch, Mr. Big, and the Peanut Butter O. Henry. And if I would have known Double Decker was this good, I would have bought them too. I think it's a chocolate marshmallow. It's heaven. Their chocolate, I don't know how to say it. And I think that's the reason I like Smarties so much is because their chocolate is... It's just different. They have a different tasting chocolate. Um, Cadbury, well, yeah. okay, but listen. Cadbury's the one that effed up the Butterfinger. Butterfinger? The Butterfinger got bought out by Cadbury and I they- it, I, Was it? Yeah. How, I just remember the commercials from Bart Simpson. I loved, the old, I loved the old Butterfinger. The original one I, was I liked, I liked the BBs. When I was super those young, good. those, were, those cool. were out. Those were good. Oh, wait, no, Cadbury maybe gave it up. I don't know who owns the new Butterfly I think, Butterfinger. I think it's... Uh, oh, no, Nestle had it, and now it's owned by a company called Ferrero. Ferraro. 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 Well, Ferraro... Those are, those are the guys that make the uh, Rochers. Oh, they're the ones that make the Rochers. They screwed it up. I love the Rochers. I love the Rochers, but their Butterfinger sucks. You can yeah. get all this, by the way, on Amazon, that's what we're saying. It's expensive, though. Really? Do you want to know how much I paid for these? Two for a dollar. That was a Canadian dollar. So that was like two for 66 cents. You were basically a millionaire going on there, huh? Okay, well, let's talk about that. <laughs> so so they don't have home goods. They don't have TJ Maxx. What they have up there is they have something called Home Sense, <laughs> Marshalls, and Winners. Winners. And everyone knows that Marshalls and Home Sense has Ray Dunn, but I'm not sure people know it's at Winners. And everyone kept saying, oh, it's not going to be at Winners. It's mostly a clothing store. Well, guess what? It's yeah. at Winners, and I don't think anyone knows it's there because we hit the mother you-know-what jackpot. Well, I did. <laughs> you sat in the car. Like, I was so excited. And nothing's worse than discovering done in the wild and nobody cares. Like, I'm like, oh my gosh, I found a hot cocoa pot. Nobody cares. Like, red mugs galore, green mugs galore, hard to find items up here like fa la 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 and green and believe in green and red mugs and stitched mugs and cocoa pots and like... Here's the deal. Listen, listen, Ryan. When you go shopping, you get some done pieces, and you're like, oh, here's a, here's a pop. And so, like, and just keep in mind, I'm shopping for all these, like, crazy people in the U.S., all my friends, like, you know, that need it. So I'm like, oh, Sean. He's like, well, you better get it. You better get it. Until we got home, well, to, the, to Isabel's house, and we were packing it. And then I realized the amount we bought. Well, first off, they don't even know how much was up here when you guys got here. I, it was it was box like like the one room was completely listen, full. Listen, the whole listen. hallway was full. Those are all gonna find good homes. <laughs> I potentially have forty two birdhouses. Okay, we will potentially find homes for all forty two birdhouses. I'm a giver. I want to make sure people get birdhouses. Okay, so I bought <laughs> them because I had the opportunity, and now I'm gonna give them away. Okay, but listen. So we're wrapping it because obviously we were gonna ship it, but then we realized like we have literally like two hundred pounds of done. And so we're wrapping it. So we put it, in, you know, you got to make sure it's protected. Sean went and bought bubble wrap. We wrapped it. So 
I don't have the picture. I should have. Do you have it? I might have it. So we're wrapped. Oh, there they are. <laughs> so I send it to all my done friends that I bought for, the ones that wanted certain pieces. You get the cup one too. Okay. So um, I send it to them. I said, if we're all ready to go. So I send them these photos. Leave it to my friend, Allison. So here's all the mugs wrapped up. There's all the canisters wrapped up. Okay, and I'm all excited, so I send it to my friend, Ali, and other people. I'm like, oh my gosh, I have her done. And literally, Allison goes, you are going to get stopped at the border looking like you are smuggling in heroin and meth. Yeah, and I was that like, looks bad. What? And she was like, that's what meth and heroin looks like when they <laughs> smuggle it in. So then I was paranoid, and the guy literally asked at the border, we're crossing him with our friend Angela, Sean's, you don't even see Sean, there's so much done in the back, right? You can't see him. He rolls down the window, the guy's like, hi, Sean. He's like, what's in the boxes? And I was like, Ray Dunn Pottery. And he was like, what? And I was like, Ray Dunn Pottery, would you like my receipts? And I had all these receipts in my hand. He goes, no, thank you, I'm good. Oh, <laughs> I was like, yeah, so Cause Sean goes, if he opens one box, they literally, he was like, you could though, you could probably put drugs inside those That's, canisters. Don't say that. No, don't do that. No, don't. But I'm just saying, but it did look like, and Allison was like, why does my friends always result to me? Look, what? What? It doesn't look like, I don't I don't know what that, is that what they wrap it in, is bubble wrap? Do they wrap heroin and meth in bubble wrap? I don't know. It, it's just, I think it's the orange, so. I uh, can't. So is there still stuff in Canada? Like a whole bunch of red and stuff still? Yes, here's the deal, Ryan. This guy, this guy, on my last day, I went to two winners, a Marshalls and a Home Sense, and I said, let me just go in and check. And he says, unless it is something extremely rare, you cannot buy it. We so, had no room. Okay, listen. We could have found room because <laughs> you want to see what breaks someone's heart? You want to see something that breaks your heart, Sean? You want to see something that breaks your heart? Sure. This, I left behind. Look at all of that. Look at all those canisters. Look at those cups in the bottom corner. And those are all, all of those. California all exclusives. Those, all la la la's, ho ho ho's. Santa's, I left it all behind because Sean is a Grinch. Oh, what else did Ken leave behind? Let me show you. Okay, let me show you. Fa la la mugs, gone. Nope, had to leave it behind because Sean said no. Said no. So it's all, well, it's probably not there anymore because, you know, but also left these behind. Mm hmm. Bye. Look at all of those mugs down there. I, 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 can't even speak. I can't, I don't have words. Do you know what it's like to literally be in front of red and green mugs and canisters? Not just one, not two, like canisters, 50 you canisters. What? You didn't say anything about green canisters. There is, I, I didn't say green. I said green and red mugs and canisters. Oh. This, Sean, you made me say no to that. Mm-hmm. You were, uh, no how, there was do you no know more room. Many, do you know how many people are going to go to bed on Christmas Eve without those canisters crying because that's all they want for Christmas? <laughs> Look, Race. you're going green. Like, so, Blinda Water said, my daughter was upset because there was a new shipment of Christmas Ray Dunn at TJ Maxx and she uh, had to get home because I had her girls and had an appointment. Did you know about that? There was a shipment? There's always a shipment. There's always a shipment. You just never know what it's going to be. You don't know what's going to be there. Oh. And unlike Canada, the U.S. doesn't bring it out. Canada, they bring it out for you. I know. That's like, a, that's quality service. <laughs> Why don't I work at TJ Let's get me in TJ Maxx and I'll... I'm telling you. Mm -hmm. I know. Go up to Canada. Get those canisters. They're all left behind. Uh-oh. Silly. <laughs> I know, right? No music, chick ch art. Go there. They're all, they're all there. Did you find measuring cups? Sorry, no, no measuring cups. Still... No measuring cups. Whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. So, anyways, yeah, we will never see that over here. I know. We'll never see it over here. Like, they've heard... Hor the sad thing is, is I asked them at home since. I was like, so do you guys have people that search trade done? She was like, yeah, we do and stuff. The closer you got to the U.S. border, the stricter the rules got with it. So, where we were in, like, London, Ontario area, they would bring it out to you. No one was, like, anything. But when you got closer to the border, right across the border, they're like, yeah, we don't bring it out. We don't say anything because people cross the, from the States over to here. And I'm like, we're ruining it. Yes, Ryan. So, Joanne uh, Visho from YouTube said, did you ever show a video displaying what you guys made during the Employee Appreciation Day? I don't even know if it's ready for pickup. Have you gotten a call from them? 
Hey, Polka dot pottery? Should be done. It's yes, it's done. And when something happened to one. <gasps> she didn't say what. So yes, it is ready. We're fired. <clears throat> we don't know which one something happened to whose. I don't Do know. we get a credit back? I don't know. We'll find out when we go down hey, it's there. Probably the, I bet it's mine. She's like, screw this guy. Like, I can't right now, guys. Yes, All right. It, yes, it is ready. Maybe, so we got to get that soon. Um, so for those of you who do not know what happened to Sean's arm, we had a windstorm. Or no, we had a snowstorm. Snow got heavy. Then it froze, broke the trees. Trees came down. Sean took ladder, didn't secure it, went up, decided to pull on a tree. Tree broke. Sean fell, broke wrist. Almost died. No. But at no point during that start and finish did Sean ask for help. Ladder safety should always be the number one rule. Huh, Sean? That's true. We tried to chalk on it, but now it just looks like pigeon poop. Yeah, I was going to say, what happened to that? Is it just because there's too many like holes? In yeah, it? it's it's not. It's the surface it's and way, the chalk. Way too and boring. he literally is sitting there and he's like, I feel it. I feel it. It's wet now. It's wet because the chalk kind of soaked through to it. Couldn't yeah. you guys put like, if you guys put like a, I guess like a. Mm -mm, it didn't work. See, look at it. Well, I was talking about, like, Here, let's go to the camera and we'll show you. We tried. We did it before because we were at Isabel's and I was like, let's chalk on Sean's cast today. Oh, that camera's done. Let's put iron oh, there on it. Is. it. So that's what it looked like. So that was a Merry Christmas icon, like the, our icon set. And Sean's like, that didn't work. And then I tried to wash it off and I can't get it off now. So it, now it just looks like pigeon poop. Let's yeah. iron it. Iron it on. He said it. Burn his arm. <laughs> Did you use the chalk marker? I have not yet. Um, there was no chalk markers up there. Isabel had given them or uh, sold them all to classes and stuff. So she didn't have them. So. So guys, um, I got to get going. We have a bazillion and a half things to do. The people that finished um, or built our shed just left and it's completely finished. We'll have to show you a video of that soon. Um, we will be back tonight for our 45 days of live. If you have been missing that, there is a playlist down below <laughs> that will take you to that. Um, big thing to remember is this Cricut sale. So if you want this Cricut Cutie, the Blush Cricut Cutie, I would not wait. It is a Cricut Access exclusive. You have to be a Cricut Access member. You have to spend $100 on material and accessories. Now, material and accessories are 40% off. So it's $100 sub subtotal. So if you do, let's say, um, you get a whole bunch of uh, accessories, you get a whole bunch of uh, materials, uh, infusible inks, 30% off. So let's say you're getting all this stuff. You have to be at a subtotal of $100. So after coupon discounts, after access, all of that, you have to be $100 and then you'll get that blush cutie. The longer you wait, the potential of you maybe not getting it does increase because there's limited quantities and other cuties will be substituted. Um, don't forget 40% off all materials except for infusible ink, which is 30% off. 40% off all tools and accessories with the exception of infusible ink, which is 30% off. $49.99 on the Cricut um, mini easy press, um, great, great sales. 10 can get you an additional 10% off access member, get you an additional 10% off. I don't know if this is better than black Friday, but this is a pretty good deal. And that cricket cutie is a pretty big deal. It is very huge. I need that blush credit in my life. Mine and I need that yellow. Huh? Uh, mine froze. So, oh, sorry. No, you're okay. <clears throat> Did you re relaunch? Yeah. All right, guys, so um, so don't forget to use the links under the video. Yes, um, we will show you the shed once it is all done. All of our decor mm -hmm. is going out there, but we still have stuff to unpack, clean, get ready for our live tonight. Um, I have to get caught up with my team page because literally we were flying and Sean was stressing me out all yesterday because we were this close to missing the flight. Like, literally... He hates yeah. running in an airport, too. Nothing <laughs> upset Sean more than running in an airport. Yeah, it sucks. Especially when you're out but of But at shape. least it was, it literally, though, it was, it was like just down and over. So it wasn't... D D13 down to D2. So yeah, it really so it wasn't, wasn't that far, and they were waiting for us, I think, because there was another four or five people they after should, us that By the time on. we actually got to the door, the door should have been shut. It should have been, it but I think they shut. were holding well, they probably it. probably knew. Well, it was the last flight out to Spokane, so that meant they would have had they to pay knew. hotel for all of those people. Yeah, it's cheaper well, to do that. I, then. I was also going to say, like, if, if they know a plane's late, I feel like they should know that people are coming. But they can't hold the plane. It would throw all the schedule off. But all they the can schedules. if it's the last plane leaving for the night, yeah. because the only other option is they would have to get us on a flight in the morning and play for a hotel, get us there and back. So yeah, it's, cheaper it's that way, better to, to hold, hold it. it for people. Yeah, than there was like so we seven, out. seven or nine of us that were yeah, on our we Detroit plane. We were very, plan. very lucky because Sean was like, it's okay. It's 
It's okay. It'll be fine. Like, it's It'll fine. Be it is what it is. And he's we like, could have gone. We could have gone. And then they text me. They're like, we need you at the house. And you know, because I was like, he was all worried about the shed and stuff. So, all right, guys. We will see you later tonight. 45 Days Alive. Thank you for using our leaks and supporting this channel. Um, we truly do love you. And that helps uh, support all of us and keep the team together uh, for a couple months. Yeah. So, all right. Bye, everyone. Bye, Brian.